Okay, the first thing I want to do is just take this moment to apologise to my bank account for Black Friday. Um, I accidentally bought things that I probably shouldn't have bought. Um, but you know, I thought I'd also save them until this video to open them. So they actually, no, I picked them up yesterday. And, well, they arrived in store yesterday and I went straight to pick them up because I was in the area anyway, obviously. Um, I didn't go wrong way or anything. Um, but yeah, I just couldn't resist picking them up straight away and getting into them straight away. But I did wait until today to open them so that you could see me open them. But yeah, the next sale in the store, there was only, there was only like, I don't know, just a like, couple of rails of things as you went into the store. It wasn't, it was like 75% off, but it wasn't, there wasn't that much selection. There just wasn't that much there, but online, which was really difficult to find. I don't know whether anyone else had trouble um, finding the Black Friday sale online for next. It was just really hard because you type in next Black Friday sale and it would come up with today is the next Black Friday sale, as in next, not the shop next it was really difficult i found it hard anyway um, and then on the site you went onto it it wasn't like on all the other clothes shops and everywhere else if you went onto their website it was immediately black friday sale click here next didn't have that it was just really difficult to find anyway i found it i bought some stuff and let's get stuck in right let's see what i bought it's it's one of these things with next as well it's very difficult to see what the clothes actually look like in their sales section because on, on the normal section when you click on clothes it shows you the model in them it shows you like loads of different angles of the product when you look on their sale there's only one picture and it's usually like really difficult it's just a model wearing it and it's really difficult to see because they're in a weird pose or something or a strange angle and you can't actually see what the thing looks like so it's a bit of a risk when you buy them so I may be taking some stuff back I think I know what this is it's a polar neck because you can't have enough polar necks in winter at all this time of year and I've only really got polar necks that are literally like just from Primark so I thought this would be nice I got it in a size 12 usually 12 pound I'll put a little thing in the description about how much these were when I bought them because um, well, whether there's any left I don't know I'll put a link to the site just in case um, yeah you may have missed out on some of these things but this is quite thinner than I expected to be honest but quite a nice colour I don't know whether it's coming across really well but it's like a purpley colour but a really subtle light purple I really like it like a mauve a mauve I don't know how to say that word um yeah it seems quite nice to be honest it's kind of got like a little sleeve cuff there it's just straight on the bottom and just not too high a neck really just simple I just thought that would be really nice just to wear with a pair of jeans or even for work with a skirt or something um I just think it's really simple and a really nice colour really like that colour beautiful I should try that on. I think this one's a yes. It's kind of a little bit thinner than I thought and a little bit tighter than I thought, but I do think I like it. Yeah, I think possibly a keep. Don't know, I'm talking myself out of it now. Um, I do really like the colour. Um, you can't really go wrong with a, with a polar neck top, can you? Let me know whether you think I should keep it. I'm really not sure <laughs> on this one. Oh yeah, so it's a black dress, again with the high kind of collar, not quite a polar neck, just like a little bit of a high neck, but it looks really nice, really simple, literally just a plain black dress, kind of skater style, with the kind of flares out a little bit there, it's not like tight figure hugging all the way down, um, long sleeved, really soft material, quite thick, so I just thought that would be really simple for work um, or for any occasion really. You could kind of dress that up for the evening if you like. Not that I go out that much but you know the possibilities are there. <laughs> um, yeah I think that's really simple. I mean can't really show you much here so I'm sure in the shot of me trying it on it will just show you it in a little bit more detail. Um, this was in size 10 usually £24. This one which I thought would probably be a yes is a no. It's just I mean it's a size 10 so it's a little bit too tight on me as well, I just feel like it hooks me in all the wrong places but also it's just, it's just a bit like short and I don't know cheap looking, it just looks a bit rubbishy, I don't know, just not really feeling it at all, doesn't do anything for me, I don't like it. Oh I don't know about this one, hmm, 
Hmm. I'm not sure. Okay. It's a cold shoulder top because obviously I'm obsessed with cold shoulder tops. I just think they're really flattering and really comfortable to wear. Now I think this is definitely going to need, as you can tell because the light just goes straight through it, a little vest top underneath. Do you know what? I think I might be able to pull this off. It's it's like a glittery material, um, but only very subtle. It's not like full glitter. There's just like the odd little glitter thread that's been like sewn through and it's green, like a khaki green, which I love at the moment. So I picked this up in a size 10, normally 18 pound. And I think, I don't know, I'll try that on and see what I think, but I think I might be able to do something with that. It's a little bit different for me, um, but I think it's still got my kind of safety net of, it's a little cold shoulder, it's a nice subtle colour, I might be able to pull it off. We shall see. I've had to put on a little strappy top underneath this one and the only colour I could find was grey. Um, but I don't know, I'm a little bit unsure. It is nice, I just don't know if it will get a little bit scratchy and itchy after a while because it's because it's kind of got that like glittery feel um I don't mind it I don't know it was kind it kind of fitted better and looked better without the little vest top but at the same time you could see through it completely so I don't know I'm not sure yeah I'm starting to feel my arms itch actually yeah no mmm this, this is one of these examples of the model was wearing it and you really couldn't see what it actually looked like because she was wearing like a jacket over it and some boots and I just, I'm just like leaning against a wall and you couldn't actually see it from head on. I didn't really know what it was going to come out like. The material was the, re not the material but the pattern was the reason that I went for it because I thought the pattern looked absolutely beautiful. Look at that. That is gorgeous. It looks like some sort of like not a rug, like a like a throw, doesn't it? Oh well, if I don't if I don't like it on, I'll just use it as a throw. I think that's beautiful. Now it was maxi dress. I didn't I didn't know whether I ex I didn't expect this material. It's like a woolly material, and it's inside out. No, it's not. Okay. Oh, I just I don't know a woolly dress. It's absolutely beautiful though. Look at that. So. It's got like a v-neck at the front, little short sleeves and then it's quite long and it's got a tie waist and then it goes all the way down. Has it got a little split? Maybe just a little tiny split that side and the other side actually, both sides. So it's really pretty. I just don't know about the material. A woolly material. I can't get over how beautiful it looks, like it is gorgeous. Materials just really thrown me. I don't know. I've never worn a woolly a dress that kind of like. I've never worn any clothes that kind of material. It's a bit like a jumper material, but a little bit different. I don't know. We'll see what it looks like on. But this is a size 10 and originally £30. I think it was a bit of a bargain from what I remember, so I thought I'll try it. Yeah, we'll give that a go. I've no idea what that will look like on. Here is this dress. I was so unsure about it um, when I was showing it you before. I don't know still. Um, I think it's beautiful. Like I absolutely still really, really love the print. Really, really love the shape of it. It actually fits really, really nicely. The fact it has pockets is amazing. Um, and a little like belt around here. Do you know what? Yeah, and, and it kind of goes longer. I don't know if you can see this. It's longer on the back than it is on the front as well. It's beautiful. It's just, yeah, I think I'm convinced. It's a really nice dress. It's just getting used to the fact that it's a strange material. It's just not the usual dress material that you'd expect. But I think, I just love that it's so different. I think I really like it. I don't know what I'll wear it for. Like, I have all these clothes, you know. And if you see me every day, I literally just wear whatever's comfortable. I don't even go, like, <laughs> as nice as you'd think the clothes that I have, the clothes that I wear, I don't have enough occasions to kind of put nice things on. Kind of just everyday life is just comfortable jeans and a jumper or something. Um, but yeah, this is a beautiful dress. If any of my friends want to go for a meal or something, I will wear this dress for you. <laughs> Please give me an occasion to wear this dress for, because it is beautiful. I think I'm gonna keep it. I just picked up a couple of t-shirts as well because they were like three pound each or something. Let's see what this one is. 
Oh, this is interesting. Okay. It's a bit of a, okay. Size 10, originally 14 pound. And this is a gray t-shirt. Looks a little bit like that kind of like worn gray and it's got little stripes down there. Well, little seams down there that are lighter gray. And then the sleeve, the end of the sleeve has a little bit of, not ruffle, it's just, it's as if it's been cut really badly. It's like a homemade t-shirt, this. And the other one, if it wasn't tucked in, is the same. And then at the bottom, this is interesting, it's got like, like a lacy, rough lace at the bottom. I don't know, that looks kind of cute. As I said, it was probably like three pound or something. I'll check how much it was, let you know in the description. It's a simple t-shirt, just a little bit, a little bit different. I don't know, see if I suit it. Yeah, I really like this one. It's got kind of nice like thickness to it. Really comfortable feel, really comfortable fit. And yeah, it's gray, so I absolutely love gray anyway. So that's nice and easy, but it's got a really nice, oh, a really nice cute little like lace detail to the bottom. And I really like that. I think it just gives the t-shirt a little bit something else, just a little bit more interesting than a plain t-shirt. Yeah, I think that's definitely a keep. This is a dress, like a little tunic kind of dress. I just thought it would go nice with some tights or some leggings and a little cardigan maybe. Oh, I've gone for the cold shoulder look again, look. Oh, do you know what? I really like this colour actually. It's really pretty. Um, so it's got a little, has it? Hang on a minute, what am I doing? Has it got a cold shoulder? Oh, it has. Oh, it's strappy at the top. There you go. So it's little straps at the top there and then it's got that cold shoulder look still. So this bit just rests on your upper arm at the side there, but it's just straps. So I'm one of these people who have to wear a bra and I can't really go strapless and things. So I like to, I don't really do straps usually, but doesn't matter too much like but I'll usually probably just put on a cardigan or something to stop you seeing my bra straps that's a really like flowy dress and a really pretty pattern I think you can get away with wearing this in the autumn or the summer really it's quite a subtle nude kind of pink yeah I like that I think that's quite cute I've got it in a size 10 so I'm not sure I'm one of these people who's in one of these people why do I keep saying that phrase I'm like in between a size 10 and a size 12 sometimes so depending where the item's from, what kind of style it is. Sometimes I can squeeze into a size 10, sometimes it's size 12. Sometimes I can squeeze into a size 8 and it doesn't even feel like small. Sometimes just sizing is just odd. So yeah, um, I've just tangled that up, but we'll see what it looks like on. This is a little bit more, this is a little bit more dressy than I thought it was gonna be. I know it's a dress, I should have expected it, but it's quite, um, well, I did get it in a size 10, I think, so it's quite fitted. Um, but yeah, I just expected it to be a bit more casual. And I feel like it's quite, I don't know, quite dressy, quite nice for a little evening or something. Definitely not a work thing, because I feel like I'm a bit exposed, to be honest. Um, yeah, it's kind of like breathing. Um, but yeah, I do really like the, I like the shape of it. I do like it. I suppose you could make it a little bit more, you know, a little bit more covered up, a little bit more casual with with a cardigan. Um, I think, yeah, that's a little bit, a little bit more comfortable. <laughs> but yeah, if you wanted to kind of dress it up properly, you could put some heels on and wear it, you know, wear it for the evening without a cardigan. I think I'm gonna keep it though. Jim's already liked it, so I think I'm gonna keep it. Oh, it's a bit thin. No, not feeling it. I don't know, hmm. It's, I guess it'll be cute in summer. It's got a little tie front. So it's just kind of like, tied up at the bottom there just to kind of add something more interesting I think that's why I got it I thought I like the colour it looks quite cute for summer and just has something different going on on the side so it's not just a plain 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 t-shirt I don't know it does look quite thin but it might be fine in summer as I say or maybe in winter with, with a little strappy top underneath strappy tops save save the world don't they that's not that's a bit extreme really this is the little t-shirt um it is a little bit see-through to be honest um so yeah i think i'll probably be sending it back just because of the see-throughness of it um and i'm showing everyone on youtube the fact that it's see-through but it's one of those things like a lot of people wouldn't mind 
this being quite thin, I wouldn't mind that you can see your bra through it, but I just don't, I don't know, yeah, I wouldn't feel comfortable. I just prefer to not see it. I don't know, yeah, I would prefer not to see it, but I do love this little, little like design on it. I do love the fact it's got that little tie waist bit. It is pretty, it's nice, it's comfortable. I just think I'll probably send it back because um, it is just a little bit too thin for my liking. Right, that is everything in that bag. But I do have one more bag. They put shirt dresses in giant bags, like really long ones. I don't like to fold them up, which is nice. Keeps them straight, but you walk at the shop looking like you bought a hell of a lot of stuff. This is size 10 in tall, which is handy because I do need tall sometimes because my legs are ridiculously long. Oh, this is lovely. I absolutely love that. Do you know, I'm glad I got it in a size 10. So I, sometimes, as I say, I wasn't sure whether to go size 10 or size 12 with this one, um, but I went for the size 10 and it actually looks quite big. So I'm glad this is beautiful. The material feels really, really soft and it's khaki green again. There's a little bit of a theme going on here, isn't there, with my khaki green colours. It's got a little pocket here. It's buttoned all the way through with I thought that was a pattern then but it's just creased <laughs> i think that's really weird definitely looks like a pattern on the screen there and um, little gold buttons all the way down and pockets yes it has pockets i love a dress with pockets and the sleeves are just kind of quite casual rolled up there and fastened you can probably have them rolled down as well and it's really really long because it is for from the tall section as well which helps because sometimes things will shrink in the wash as well and they end up just being too short for me which is a bit of a pain so that's definitely that's really nice i love that i hope it looks nice on 42 pounds usually that is and i'm pretty sure i didn't pay anywhere near that at all fancy labels new age fiber no wonder it's nice <laughs> there we go can't wait to try that one on. This one is a definite yes straight away. Don't even have to think about this. I just about squeezed into it though. I do think being a 10, it just kind of around this area, <laughs> that doesn't pop open, around this area, sometimes you get a little gapey hole there, but I think it's just about okay. I think I'm happy with it. I love the colour, I love a shirt dress, and I love the pockets. And the last item. Yeah, it feels nice. Okay, so this is, oh, that's such a nice pattern. Yes, I like that pattern a lot. Yeah, it's so cold at the moment that I'm just living in jumpers. So I just thought if I, I don't know, attempt to dress up smartly for work sometimes, but it's just so cold sometimes I can't, but maybe a little evening out, I could put this on, maybe. We shall see with a black tights and a little pair of boots and that should be quite nice and then hopefully when the weather warms up a tiny bit i could get away with wearing that in the summer with some sandals and without tights i think that's beautiful it's just such a nice pattern this one i did go for in a size 12 i'm okay with and it's got pockets which is really nice just kind of like three quarter length sleeves on this one with a little button at the end this one's another yes yeah, straight away. I literally don't even have to think about it with shirt dresses and pockets um, from next because they're so beautiful. Um, they just have such a nice fit. And yeah, lovely pattern. Really, really nice pattern. Lovely colours. Lovely length on it as well. Really nice length. And I'm very happy with this one. So that is absolutely everything that I bought. Hopefully I'll be sending some of these things back that don't fit and get a little bit of money back. But, you know, hopefully there's some good ones in there that will suit me as well and I get to keep. Um, thank you very much for watching this video. And if you did enjoy it, please stick around, watch the rest of my videos. Please subscribe and, yeah, let me know in the comments what you enjoyed about this video and what bargains you picked up on the Black Friday sales. And I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.